Well, groundwater storage is about to get a boost across the Sacramento Valley, and it's all thanks to a new project. Yeah, it sounds like a boring topic, but it's not. It could end up doubling the amount of water Folsom Lake holds. But would you notice the change? CBS 13's Ashley Nanfrey is getting answers live along the river. Hi, Ashley. Hey guys, yeah, this wouldn't be a change that we would see as it would be underground, but it would double the size of groundwater and actually increase our storage. But it would pull water from rivers like this one at the Sacramento River. It, it's right here beneath our feet. It's a change we can't see, but a change that's needed in Northern California. Now the state has seen a lot of groundwater level decline. After years of drought and battling the effects of climate change, our region's groundwater is not where it needs to be. And now the Sacramento Regional Water Authority is working to save it. Essentially taking extra surface water supply and using wells and, and reversing the flow that wells normally uh, operate and inject water into our groundwater aquifer beneath our feet. It's through a new groundwater bank project that could double our storage. We have the capacity to store twice the size of Folsom Reservoir in terms of, of additional water supply. It works just like a bank. In the wet years, pumps would take excess water from the Folsom Reservoir and rivers to store it underground. To take that extra water supply and inject it directly into our aquifers. And in dry years, they would draw water back up to the surface to use when it's needed most. So the amount of water we'd be taking is, is a really small percentage. And again, it's in a time where there's actually excess flow in the rivers and streams, and so we, we wouldn't be creating any impacts. By using existing infrastructure from 20 local water districts to increase storage naturally to save water and not waste it to take that extra surface water supply so it's not lost out the Golden Gate Bridge uh, as it flows out the Delta on average groundwater makes up 40% of the region's water supply but in drought it can make up 60% not having enough can impact ecosystems and homes that need it most. If we're not managing our groundwater sustainably, they can be impacted. The water level can drop below those wells and, and they can be uh, impacted by over pumping. With the goal of locking in the bank by 2024. We already have kind of a proof of concept that this type of project will work, but this is really taking it to the next level. And they are asking for the public's input on what areas they should expand to next for this big bank project. And if you have any ideas on where they should expand to, well, you can find the link to put in your input on our website, cbssacramento.com. Guys. All right. Making it easy to have your feedback yeah. heard. Thanks so much, Ashley.